We're here at Vignette, and this is in the tip making kit. Here we go. So, Cardeen, yo, tell us about this business card and why you chose this photo. Because of the history of magic, it started with the um, the the gypsies when uh, after the Dark Ages uh, when they start in Europe when they uh, it was a lost tribe from uh, India. They went to Egypt, and from Egypt they went to Europe. And that's when they went to France, is when they started using the tarot cards and wow. fortune telling. And from then on, uh, the history of cards is very interesting because you've got different uh, periods of time. I mean, look at the Old West. When I, I did, uh, I was dealing cards in Tombstone, and I was doing that era, so I, I, I could do gambling procedures from that era. You know, but I start with the steamboats with the 1840s. And the steamboats, the South, they had cotton. And they sold their cotton upriver in the Mississippi. When they went upriver, they got their money. And when they came back to the South, they had money because they sold the cotton. And guess what? All these gamblers got aboard. And they stole everything they can from these poor guys. And they were, they were gamblers. You know? That's funny. And, and then I do the procedures of, of the gambling at that time, how they stack the cards, and how, how and then I show uh, actual, I have decks of cards from the eight, eight, 1880s also, and, uh, and they're perishable. So when you get a full deck of cards from that time, they're $300, $200. Wow. Because, yeah, because they're, they're, they're full deck. But, even so, collectors buy even single cards. They buy single cards. Yeah. Yeah. What was the name of this painting in France? Uh, it's in a book. Uh, I got a book there that tells you about that painting. Huh. That's my business card, so. And you were saying that they were pickpocketing. That's what it's showing. Yeah. You see it's, the guy pickpocketing? Yeah. He's pickpocketing while, while they're doing the magic show. Yep. He's doing he's doing the cups and balls. And the kids pickpocketed too. Yeah. Yeah. See the cups and balls. Yep. He's doing the cups and balls while this he's pickpocketing the people that's watching the show. Wow. And that's uh, they were rock they they rock people the, the gypsies. And they still do. You know they still do. You know. That's what's interesting. And, uh, yeah. Yeah. And you then, want to do a trick for the, for a, a video? Just a quick little trick? Uh, a trick for what, for the video? Yeah, just a quick trick. Um, something yeah. you can do. Yeah, well, let me see. I can do, uh, you know what I do is, um, I do, uh, matrix with, um, with the kangaroo coins that I, I, I do that trick with the kangaroo coins. You know that? The kangaroo coins? Because they jump. And when you do matrix, what did they jump? Yeah. They jump. Yeah. I do that. You know? I, I do a lot of different procedures with uh, with the co I, I do coins across by uh, this is this is the one that um, let's hear our show. I carry mostly this when I do my shows. And I have everything here that I want to use, the cards. And then I do my show, I carry this. And then when I carry this, I'll show you right here. Let me open this here. This is the original one that I got from Slidini in 19, let's see, 19, uh, you see, 
1959, he was in San Francisco. And I went, uh, I saw Slidini at that time. And he was showing us his uh, coins and cross. And this is the purse. And what it is, there's a zipper on the bottom to carry your extra coin that you need. I love it. You see, now this, when I got this from Slidini, I, at that time, the, the, I used these coins here, I'll show you. What year were you born, I, I, Cardi? I bought 1938. 38. Wow. I, bought, I bought this from Slidini, and I'll show you. So you were 21 when you got that coin bag. Yeah. I was wow. Wow. Look at this. This here, you, you have six coins, okay? Right here, okay? And you have the extra coin on the bottom here. You see the extra coin? Yep. You have it here, see? But you take it out, and you don't, you, when you take it out, then you use it, you palm this one, see? I'll show you. See? Here's the extra coin, okay? These are peace dollars. They came out after World War One. these peace dollars, okay? So I put six coins in the, in the purse and I give it to the person. Now, Slidini, what he did was he had a chair where he sat at the table, but he tilted it this way, sideways, so you couldn't, couldn't, you couldn't see anything at this angle. Angle, yeah, see? To the right. now, he had a handkerchief, he had a nice suit, had a handkerchief here. So when he was gonna do this, here's what he did. All right, take any card you want. I'm gonna say this one right here. That one, okay. Remember that card, okay? You got it? Okay, I'm gonna show for the cards, okay? Okay. Like this, okay? You can place it anywhere you want in the middle, as I shuffle. Okay, right here. Right here, okay. Yep. I'm gonna place the deck down here like this, okay? okay? And I'll cast a shadow over it like that, okay? Now, once I cast a shadow, I'm gonna show you what happens. When I go through the cards, uh, oh wow, I wonder why these cards are here. This shouldn't be there. I don't know why, okay. One card turns blue. Right. You know, this card here, okay? Right. Now, you can see that this, these other cards here, there's no more blue card. That's the only blue card that's, that's, that's here, right? Right. That's the only, you know, that, the only blue card. Now, what, what was the card that you picked? Six of diamonds. Really? That's right, six of diamonds, right? Wow. Okay, now I'm gonna put the six of diamonds down over here. Okay. Okay. Now, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna pick another card again. Okay. Okay. I'll go. I'll do the Hindu shuffle again. Right. I'll do this again. Test. Okay. Okay. You, you say you could say stop anytime that you want. Okay. Stop. Right there. Right there. Okay. Look at the card. Okay. You see it. Got it. Okay. I'll put it in there again. I'll do this, cast a shadow, okay? Now once I cast a shadow, I should have another blue card that turned blue, okay? As we go through the cards, hmm, that's funny. There's not a blue card here, right? Nope. Well, the only blue card I see is this one. Right. And what was this card before? Before? Yeah, before when I put it It was it a six of diamonds. Yeah, now it's the card that the Queen of Spades, the one that you picked. Yeah, it was the Queen of Spades, I saw it. Exactly. Wow. You see that? That's real good. So the Six of Diamonds turned into the- uh, Queen of Spades. The, the second card that you picked. Very nice. Very you nice. like that? Yeah, I like, I like it a lot. So there's a lot of things you could do with the cards. Very when nice. did you learn that one, Cardine? Oh, jeez, a long time ago. But that's that's a good, uh, that's a good card. Too. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. That was great. Uh, there's so many card tricks, I tell you. 
uh, when I did my shows, I was, I wasn't the best, but I was the most expensive. You weren't the best, but you were the most expensive. Correct. That's good. That's I what like I, it. That's what I told people, you know. I like it. <laughs> just, a, just a joke, you know. No, yeah, yeah. Hey, thanks for checking out this video. If you enjoyed it, if you're new to, to uh, any type of entertainment, this trick is so quick. You can do it anywhere, any place. Has so much power. And uh, we got a whole bunch of other good ones just as good as this in the tip making kit. So if you want the tip making kit, just reach out to me, happy to get you one. And uh, you can make a lot of extra tips when you're at work, anyone in the service industry. And uh, special thanks to Cardine. Cardine's given me a lot of good advice over the years. And he actually gave me, the guy you just saw, the old timer, he actually gave me a trick uh, with the $2 bills. And he gave me some of these suckers. And um, he also gave me another one that he recommended I put in the tip making kit. So uh, definitely some cool stuff. If you want to see that, leave a comment down below. I'd love to know what your favorite trick is. And uh, that's your ticket into the end of month giveaway. We randomly select people from the comment section. And we will see you back next time right here on Las Vegas Magic Friends. Check out this playlist here. And check out this one here if you want to subscribe to the channel. Tap this little circle here that'll let you subscribe. We'll see you back next time right here on Las Vegas Magic Friends.